14th. It's the 14th. Yeah. Okay, good. We're doing an interview with Ron Short. Um, the first thing I wanted you to talk about is uh, when you came to work at Roadside, uh, why, uh, when that was, and why, and what were you doing? This is, uh, you know, the very beginning. Okay. Um, it, was a, it was a kind of a transition period. I was working um, for, at Highland, the Highland Research and Education Center in Newmarket, Tennessee. And uh, Roadside came to um, Knoxville, um, to Epworth, and, and did a show. And I was just, um, even though I was only in Knoxville, uh, I felt like I was away from my home, which was here. Um, and Knox was only 110 miles away, but it's a, it's a cultural way. I mean, it's a, it's a, a landscape away, uh, and uh, a landscape of culture, I guess. And so, um, when I saw this piece by them, I was just immediately home, struck by the, the what I remembrances of as a child growing up listening to the storytelling, but seeing it in a new kind of extraordinary way. And I wrote for the. Uh, the um, Highlander uh, newsletter, so I did a little review, a little arts review, and uh, then um, the, I guess Dudley read that and, and called me and said, how would you like to come work for Roadside? I said, you crazy, I got enough trouble down here. Uh, but then things transpired, I, I moved back up here within the next couple of years. And, and they kept talking to me, well, would you be willing to do some music? Because I was a musician and they wanted some music in the, in the plays. And I said, yeah, I might be willing to, you know, work on some music and stuff. And would you be willing to write something? And so I, next thing I knew, I had been recruited, basically. I, I, it was a, just at a time in my life when I realized, um, this is really what I should be doing. I had grown up thinking I needed to get one of those good jobs, you know, because coming from a family of people who don't have access to education and that sort of thing. So I um, I had kind of put that part of my own character behind me. I tried to kind of bury that under, get a good job, don't, don't be a musician, don't, you know, don't do that kind of thing. Finally, I just said, why not? And so I started work for Roadside. 